Good morning, boys and girls. Welcome to Shen Play. I'm your host, Shenra, and today we're going to start a new campaign here in Victoria 2. This will be my first campaign in Heart of Darkness, so bear with me if everything goes awry. Now, we did some polling to find out who to play as, and uh, the end result was China. So we're going to hop in as China and uh, find out how to westernize. I have not westernized in this game before. Well, actually, I think I did as Persia a long time ago. I mean, like a super duper long time ago when the game first came out. But yeah, let's hop in. Let's see what we can't do. I am very, 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 very rusty with Victoria 2. So please do bear with me. There will be some floundering and some uh, horribleness. Hope you don't mind horribleness. Uh, right, we can't do any research because we're uncivilized. Uh, our economy seems to be in the garbage. Well, let's uh, tax the shit out of those poor folk. Wow, look how much taxes we can do. It's amazing. Tax the poor. Uh, we can probably keep military spending where it is, but we're going to need education and administration. Wow, that's expensive. Uh, yeah, maybe we stay on speed one for a little bit. and Let's see if we can't cover all this stuff. Oh, that doesn't go away? Damn. All right, where is our most populated area? Population. Northern Zeely. <laughs> where the hell is Northern Zeely? Can I go there? Can't right click to go there? No. Northern Zeely. What the fuck is Northern Zeely? Oh, that's our capital region. All right, capital region is called Northern Zeely. We're going to go encourage some vacation there. Clergymen for the win. Uh, because our our literacy is 3.5%. <laughs> it's just trash. Our literacy is a joke. Our literacy is a joke. Oh my god. Oh, Alright, so to start out with a bunch of units, uh, why don't we group up in the capital area. Put some people in Chengdi. Put some people in the actual capital. Uh, we don't need you morons down there. Why don't you come up here? Uh, or at least right there. Everyone get to the coast. Can you do that for me? Get to the fucking coast? There you go. Look at me, we just started. I'm already, I'm already swearing. Yeah. yeah. Vicky too will do that to you. Alright. Uh, and there's our border with Russia. Our massive, friendly... I repeat, friendly border with Russia. Uh, what we're going to do is mass up on this friendly, I repeat, friendly border with Korea over here. They wouldn't mind us massing on their border, would they? No, they won't mind that. Right, what do we got with the supply of 32? Perfect. Well, we'll send a few more folks over there. Supply of 32. All right, well, you can go over there. Uh, we're going to immediately just send out a little diplomat. A fr oh, what's this say? Are we allies? We're allies. Oh... Oh, I plan on attacking this guy from the start, but apparently we're allies. Well, maybe we can go for Dai Nam instead. Hmm. Little Vietnam for breakfast, maybe? Maybe. What kind of uh, causes Billy can we get here? Acquire states. No, I don't want to do acquire states. Don't want to do... Oh, we can do a conquest on Dai Nam. As long as he has less than five states, then we can conquest them. Well, that might work, since we're allied with Korea. Hmm. Korea isn't a puppet, so there's no point. What do you mean there's no point? I'm confused. What do you mean there's no point? There's no point what? <laughs> I really dislike it when people give half sentences. It's like, we're going to make a point here, but we're not going to tell you what the point is. you got to figure it out yourself. No. Either you see the full story, or you shut up. <laughs> uh, oh, is this uncolonized? Yeah. Oh, no. What is this? Oh, yeah. It's just uncolonized stuff. I'm sure Russia will colonize that stuff. Not a problem. Uh, but, yeah. We can always go for uh, little Dynam down here. He has three states. Yeah, three states. And he owns them entirely. Uh, Korea has four states, so that might be... No well, yeah, I mean, they're both good. Three states, four states. 
Whatever. Oh, I do read chat, just not a whole lot. I try to check in, but it does scroll by pretty quick. Yeah, yep. You're getting timed out, my little friend. So, what do you guys think? Should we break our alliance with Korea and go for them, or should we go for Dynam first? I had planned on going for uh, Korea, but he starts out as an ally, so I'm not sure if we should do that. You know? Is he our only ally? Bum, 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 bum. No, yeah, yeah, he's our only ally that's not a vassal. All the rest of these guys over here are all vassals. No, we don't need a pole. Manchuria is a vassal. We don't have to worry about them. Manchu Manchuria. Outer Manchuria. They're all vassals. You don't have to worry about them. Well, it's going to be one or the other. We're not going to be able to go both. Yeah, China, China doesn't need allies. That's true. I'm not sure if allies would really help us at all. Like Japan, we could probably... No, they won't want an alliance. Really? Why not? What's it say? Uh, bu -bu 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 Base reluctance, negative 50. That's what. Go for Dynam. All right, let's start on Dynam then. Bum, bum, bum. Go for conquest on him, and we just kind of cross our fingers and hope that we don't get uh, too severely hit with uh, infamy because it can get up to 22 for that conquest CB. No guarantee you'll get that much, but you can. All right, let's put some dudes on his border. Uh, put some more dudes on his border. Uh, some more dudes on his border. 32, at least stay there. Come on down here. Down to 24. Four. You can go there. You can, go, can, I, can I handle that many? 16. Not really. Okay, you can back up a bit. There you go. You guys, come on down here. Go that way. Uh, yeah, we could play with our political party a bit. Bop, bop, bop. That's diplomacy. Politics. Politics. We are imperial. There's no option for fascist. There's reformers, which is liberal, conservatives, which are reactionary, or imperial. I mean, at this point, it may not matter so much. But yeah, we got to go through all these reforms, the research points reforms, before we can westernize. Uh, and I think the easiest way to do that is probably just going to be kill people. How does Japan westernize quickly? They have uh, when they start when Japan starts, they have a decision, the early Meiji restor whatever it's called, Meiji Reformation. Uh, they can do that at the beginning of the game. And if they do, then it helps them westernize a lot more quickly. In any case, uh, let's unpause and let's see if our economy is going to be balanced at all. Ugh. Speed 2? No, the economy is not balanced. Alright. Let's rectify things. Hmm, 820 bucks. It's so expensive. Well, we don't need the naval funding, but that's like nothing anyway. This is cheap as hell. Uh, maybe... Oh, man. Put the admin down a bit. And the education. Oh, I hate to do that, but it does help. That did help quite a bit. All right. Let's see if that's enough to level things out. Not really. We're still losing 100 ducats a month. Wow. Or a day. Ducats. This isn't EU4. <laughs> Gain prestige. Yeah. We just gained 8 prestige. We're number 15 in the world with in prestige. Look at that. That is amazing. God, our economy. Oh. The middle class are just getting raped. Oh, man. We got discovered right away. 19 infamy. Ouch. That's pretty brutal. Oh man, look at the middle class. They are just, they are not happy. Holy crap. I 
And we are seriously failing on education here. But what choice do we have? We have no research points coming in. <laughs> oh, man. I can't believe we got 19 infamy. That's just brutal. Yeah, we've got taxes as low as we can, and they're still... 40% of the people are still not getting their needs met. That's kind of sad. Even the poor at full taxes are doing just fine. Oh, man. All right. Pause. Uh, well, we're going to have to tax them a bit, even though they don't have any money for their life needs. So what choice do we have? Got to tax them. All right. Our vassals are starting to produce some armies. That's nice. He's allied with Burma now. Okay. Man, I can't believe we took 19 infamy. That is pretty brutal. Oh, and we got Mission to Die Nam. Means it takes longer to get our, our claim. <laughs> Not the best start. Oh, man. Not the best start. All right, you're in the capital. Uh, why don't we bring you down? We'll probably need some backup armies. And wow, the arrow keys don't do anything in this game. Arrow keys don't move the camera around very well. Whoa, get off my face. Why is my vassal standing on? Oh, it's because it's his capital. All right, I'll stay out of your capital. You stay out of my face. Okay, deal, deal. All right, that's better. Okay, we got our CB. Pause. Uh, he still only has the two allies, so let's go rip him apart. Uh, declare war. Yes, conquest. We need 85 war score. Done. Uh, Korea, you want to come? I mean, I assume he wants to come. Let's party. And our vassals should do a lot of the work for us, which is nice. Yeah. They're sieging for us as well. Uh, let's go to their capital. Pew, 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 pew. And they're down. Good. And we're under attack. Let's uh, bring you guys in. And you guys as well. That should be fine. Yep, they're already retreating. Oh, we got a newspaper. What's up? War between Chile and Bolivia. The fears of Braunschweig. Hanoverian research complete. Mexico expands. Really? They got Denver. Win to westernization. Yup. All right. Well, it's a good start. Yeah, I think we'll let the vassals do all the work from here on. Oh, look. <laughs> Burma's up here. What's up, Burma? What's up, Burma? Poor Burma. Yep, vassals are doing the work. Good. I'll help. A little bit. So what should we do after uh, Dai, Dai Nam? We're going to have to wait a while because 19... Uh, where's us? Where's me? Show me. There we go. 
19 is pretty bad, you know? Max is 25 for infamy. And we got stuck with 19. We're going to have to wait uh, a while after this war. What should we do after this war? Yeah, this game only encompasses 100 years. It's a very uh, short time span compared to other Paradox titles. But it does have the best music out of all the Paradox titles. <laughs> More tea? Yeah, I like tea. Alright, I think... Wow, Burma is just getting raped. What are we at anyway in the score? We're at 44. All right, it's going to take some time. Uh, Yeah, I guess we'll siege a little more. Our vassals are getting distracted, so we'll siege a little more directly. He's putting up resistance. He's resisting. Kill him. How dare you resist? Who's this? Burma wants peace. What's up, Burma? Uh, you want a peace out. You got it. Well, no. You're actually helping my war score, so no. See, I wish I could go and ex-Burma as well, but that would be way too uh, expensive on infamy. We're going to lose that battle, aren't we? Uh, bu, 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 bu. Is there a split in half button? No, there's not. Ah, eh, whatever. Bring the general. Good man. Yeah, we have a lot of armies. And our vassal has a lot of armies too. It's not just us. What are we up to? 55. Not there yet. White peas, no. Could I puppet you? Puppet, 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 puppet. A ten infamy, no. Get out of here. <laughs> Alright, I think our vassals are, have done the job. Uh, are we there yet? Are we there yet? Are we there yet? No. Not there yet. Yeah, you're going down, Diviet. And he knows it too. Poor guy. He really is trashed. 77, he won't peace out. What a jerk. Come on, you know you've lost. Yeah, we have a ton of infamy. We got rather unlucky. The maximum infamy we could have taken for that was 22, and we took 19. Very unlucky. Oh well.
All right, that should do it. Oh, gold rush, nice. That should do it. So let me pause and uh, peace out. Oh, they won't accept. We're at what? We're at 99, and he won't accept. Are you kidding me? You're not even kidding me. Wow. There you go. Goodbye, Dynam. Goodbye. And it says uh, Cambodia is still allied to him. <laughs> Yeah, I don't think you're allied to a non-existent nation. I'm just saying. Yeah, same thing with Burma. He's like, I, I'm allied to Dai Nam. No, you're not. No, you are not, my friend. All right, so that war is over. Uh, that'll put a nice boost in our economy. Let's uh, stop taxing the... Actually, no, we can tax the middle class. Why not? Fuck them. Uh, I want to put administration... Not, I want to put education up as high as possible. Really, really want education up there. Oh man, our taxes. Our taxes. Oh, brutal. Alright, so did that give us... Oh, what's this? War between the UK and Panjab. Alright. Victory! The war between the Chinese Empire and Dynam ended in a glorious victory. The war known as the Conquest of Vietnamese... Uh, the Conquest of Vietnamese War. Okay. Uh, Rage for... One year. Xianjiang, our best friend. Alright. Saxon Research... Prices rise. Machine parts rose. Okay. Uh, did I miss something else? I did. Tibetan government people enamored with the Chinese Empire. Okay. Brazil goes to war. The Prussian fear. Arc de Triomphe. Democracy in the U.S. All right. Well, that's that's all the headlines. You know, those newspapers are a nice touch. I like that. It's different. Oh, we dropped to number two military in the world. Someone passed us up. Probably Russia. Or Britain? Maybe Britain. No. Not Russia. Who the hell passed us up? Someone passed us up. We're number two. Well, I don't even know. Oh, it's our vassal. Our vassal passed us up. Wow. Nice job, vassal. Nice job. All right, can we do any uh, research? Don't bow, bow. Research politics, reforms. Yes, we have 1,200 research. What can we do? Hmm. No, we can't do any yet. we got to wait. Oh, wow. We, we need 6,792 research points. This is silly. Wow, we need so many research points. It's going to take forever. Let's recruit some more morons. Let's get some... Uh, just some random dudes. These are all irregulars. They don't cost much to make. They don't cost much to supply. But they don't fight very well either. That's, that's the real downer. The cav are a little better. Oh, Korea broke their alliance with us. Probably because we have infamy. A lot of infamy. Well, uh, it's a good thing I have units massed at your border, Korea. Uh, if, if you don't know what that means, it probably means we're going to invade you. I'm just saying, that's probably what's going to happen. So I wouldn't be surprised if you not have ally and only having a military score of one uh, is, is a little bit... It's, it's kind of a weak position. Set a rally point. Ah, good point. Uh, yeah. Make the rally point um, uh, Chengdi, maybe? or T Let's make it T and Jin. T and Jin. Rolling down the street, smoking Indo, sipping on T and Jin. Laid back with my mind on my money and my money on my mind. Rally point, you got it. And we'll put the ships there as well, why not? All right, so we have a little army in Diviet. Our new recruits are coming around. Very good. So how do we get... How can we maximize our research points? We've been playing for a whole year and we only have 1,200 research points. That's a little silly. I want more research. I also want our infamy to go down faster so that we can go annex Korea. 
Oh, uh, goodness. We're at 17. It has to go down, I want to say down to about 3 before we try to go for them. So it's going to be a few years, unfortunately. Hold on, Twitch chat's being a little silly. What the hell, Twitch chat? Oh well, whatever. Whatever. So yeah, now the dive yet is ours, we get a whole bunch more population. And uh, what kind of resources did they have? Let's take a quick look around their resources here. Tropical wood, food, 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 tobacco. Oh, wait, that's not ours. My bad. <laughs> we only have the coast. Uh, tobacco, silk, tobacco, cotton, tropical wood. Yeah, that's not very good. I mean, as far as the just the resources you get, we get uh, two tobacco, one silk, two tropical wood, and then just food. Just food. But there's nothing wrong with food. It's just not the best uh, stuff in the world. What is this, tea? Oh, yeah, man. I wonder if we can hold Hong Kong. We probably can. I would love to get Macau away from Portugal, who has no allies. How hard would it be? Do we have a core there? Really? Why the hell do we not have a core on Macau? That's amazing. Do we have a CB for that? We don't have a CB. We don't have a CB for Portugal. We don't have a CB to go get Macau. That's amazing. Oh. Silly. Oh well. Alright, 21 units. Move around. Keep relations up with our vassal. He's huge. Uh, you know, we might want to keep relations up with uh, Mr. Japan over there as well. Someone who might be a good friend at some point. Maybe. Maybe not. I don't know. About 21 again. Move out. Yeah, I think we recruited a lot of dudes. That's okay. You need a lot of dudes, right? If you don't have a lot of dudes as China, you're doing something wrong. Uh, our literacy is up to 3.7. <sighs> Not really making a big jump, is it? Okay, we're taxing the shit out of people. Just right through the nose. Right through the anus. We are taxing them so much that their anuses and their noses are bleeding. It's just, it's not a good situation for anuses or noses at all. More units. Group up. Split in half. Get out of the way. So our vassal's running around with stacks of 30. He's got a ton of dudes. So yeah, what do we do about research points? How can we get more of these things? It's just not enough. It's just not enough research. <laughs> yep, Taiwan is owned by us, that's true. We should probably get our dudes off that island, huh? Can we even build transports? Well, that's a damn good question. Can we even build transports? Yes, we can, all right. Um, we'll just get 10 of them. Good start. Mm -hmm. 
an X Siam. I don't think we can an X Siam. They're too big. Uh, they have they have more than four regions. They have one, two, three, four, five. They have five regions. Six regions. They have six regions. So you can't annex them with one war. You'd have to do it in multiple wars. Uh, you can fully annex someone if they have four provinces, four four states or less. Like Korea has four, so you can annex Korea. Uh, Dynam had three, so we could annex that. But Siam has six, so we can't do Siam. At least not off the bat. There's a boat. Oh, all those other states, those are all vassals. They are satellites, substates. They're vassals. Ding ding. More ding ding, please. More ding ding. Hey, the coronation of Queen Victoria. Oh god, cholera. <laughs> it's like, hey, there's a queen. Yay. Uh, yeah, cholera. Enjoy your cholera. Thanks, game. I love cholera. Cholera. Get your cholera here. I wonder if we can get relations up for an alliance with Britain. Wouldn't that be amazing to have them defend us? I think I'm going to do that. Because if Russia goes to war with us, I want uh, Britain to be my buddy. That would be fantastic. Potential decisions? Uh, there, There's none yet. At least not yet. we got to wait. There's nothing there for now. Uh. Alright, let's go pick up uh, these idiots. Get them to safety. Yeah, we're doing okay on clergymen. We'll get them up to about 2% and then we'll move on to the next province. On the boat. Go home. Oh, and they're taking attrition because because I'm a moron. And I'm not funding my navy at all. Oh, yeah, I am. I'm, they're fully funded, but they're still taking attrition because we don't have any freaking ports, do we? Can we even build a port? No, we can't. We, we, need, we need better tech. Post-Nelsonian thought. All right, well, we'll get on that as soon as we westernize. <laughs> Yeah, I don't know how we're going to westernize. It's just uh, these reforms are going to take forever. Forever. So in the meantime, we can uh, sit on our hands and let the, let the infamy roll. We're at 15. Damn. Oh, more newspapers. Coronation of Queen Victoria. Yep, yep. What else? Bum, 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 bum. Oh shit, we're taking attrition over here? Oh, because we're standing on our vassal's face. I'm sorry. I'll get off your face, vassal. Sorry. Uh, what about if we go to Ninguta? Will that work? Right, go that way. What else? Uh, Japanese insults. Reports from just coming from our correspondent in Japan. An unnamed source informs us. Series of meetings, blah, 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 blah. Oh, we're, we are feared by them. So Japan has insulted us. Well, that sucks. He doesn't want to be an ally, apparently. That's too bad, because we like each other quite a bit. Darn. France is acquiring Tunisia. Well, we're, we're, we're going to keep working on Britain if we can. We need more Diplo points, though. It takes two Diplo points to raise relations, and it goes up only by 15, I think. It's not a very large increase. But we only have 1.8. We're between Afghanistan and Panjab. Oh god, not Afghanistan and Panjab. Why? Why do you guys kill each other? Goodness, can't you all just get along? What is it over anyway? Oh, apparently the war's already over. 
I don't, I don't know who won. <laughs> someone won and someone lost. Looks like Afghanistan might have won. Yeah, our ships are taking attrition even in, even when they're docked up. Yeah, they're, they're all going to die. Uh, there's no ports, are there? They're just all dead. Okay, well, let's not build any ships for them, because we just we can't. There's no point. We're at full supply, and they just they just they they can't survive. And our economy is tanking. Goodness. Anti-Manchu feeling. Emperor, our officials have detected growing levels of discontent, even hostility towards our dynasty. Really? It looks like it's pretty darn good. What are you talking about? I mean that a sure force will deal with this. All pops in Ningbo that is not Manchu will gain militancy and consciousness and lose population. Or uh, do not waste my time with this nonsense. Oh, that's terrible. Darn it. Ninbo. Where's Ninbo? Ninbo. Ninbo. Seriously, where the hell is Ninbo? I mean, it's got to be Manchu, right? I don't see it. Huh. Another newspaper? What's up? Persia and Afghanistan. Really? Yep. Acquire Western Afghanistan. Hey, Persia's going for broke. Where is Western Afghanistan? Oh, that's a big region. Wow, Persia's going to be massive. But it's only... No, it's five provinces. What's the population like? 130k? 230k? 315k? 440k? Uh, 500... Let's just say it's about 500k. Is there anything good? Food, food, fruit, cotton, wool. Eh. I'm sure it's a cheap war goal, right? Easy to get. Afghanistan's not going to put up a whole lot of resistance, are they? Nope. Australia's down here doing their thing. Britain is not colonizing New Zealand yet, but uh, but they're here. They're here being badass Brits. It's like, hey, New Zealand's ours, man. Spain's down here, of course, in the Philippines. They don't have any cores here. Only the Philippines do. That's interesting. I wonder if uh, the Philippines will spawn. No, they won't. Oh my goodness. Anti-Manchu feeling again? All pops in Hong Kong, where is not Manchu. Oh my god. But there are no Hon there are no Manchu down there, are there? Culture by front. No, there's no there's no Manchu there at all. What's the what's the point? <laughs> oh goodness. Ah, extra tea. Very good. Oh, we're still losing money. Stop losing money. All right, making money again. I think the cholera is really hurting. The cholera and other stuff. Oh, okay, how are we? How are we? We're at uh, 14. We still have a ways to go, unfortunately. Anti-Machu feeling. The Dutch fear. I'm not too fearful of the Dutch, to be honest with you. The Brits, yeah. The Russians, definitely. But not the Dutch. I wonder how... I wonder how friendly we have to get before the Brits will consider being our buddy. If they would sphere us, that would be fantastic. You want to sphere me? Go for it. Nah, Russia's probably going to sphere us. Let's see if we can find ourselves on this on this thing. Where is it? Number one in military. There we are. So who... Oh, nobody. Nobody is influencing us at all. Wow. Nobody gives a crap about us, apparently. 
They're like, well, you're there, you're big, got a lot of people, you got a lot of army, but we don't give a damn. Uh, you guys can rot in hell. It's like, oh, well, that's that's awfully sweet of you. Especially the whole rotting in hell part. That was fantastic. I really felt like part of the team there when you told me to rot in hell. Negative 224. Civilized versus uncivilized. Too many alliances. Oh, he has too many. Oh, I have too many alliances, probably. Base reluctance. Okay, so it looks like we're not going to be able to get any allies. That's too bad. Well, we're down to 13 infamy. Still have about 10 more to go before I feel safe enough to uh, declare on Korea. Oh, lose some tea. Piss off some people. No, we'll lose the tea. Whatever. Still chilling on your border, Korea. I'm sure he enjoys that. He won't even take an alliance. Wow. Anti-Manchu feeling. You gotta stop it with this anti-Manchu feeling. That is not cool. I do not approve of the anti manchuness that I'm hearing about lately. Alright, let's get some more units while we're here. Good enough. And get your ass out of the way. Thank you. No, we're not going over the infamy limit. That's a bad idea. That's a, especially since we're not even civilized. That's a very bad idea. <laughs> well, we're, we're more than halfway to the first reform. I bet we're going to go for foreign training methods. Because this gives you a bonus to research points when you conquer people. So when we go conquer Korea, we'll take a bonus to research points. That'll be nice. But we have to first uh, get that done, which requires a metric fuckload. 6,856 points that we don't have. Siam fears us. No shit. I can't imagine why they would have fears. What do you have to fear from me, Siam? You're too big to annex. You have, you have too many states. I can't annex you in one war. So you can just sit at home and relax. Don't fear me. Extra T, very good. Sixty five. About military access. No, negative one hundred and thirty nine. Really? That's surprising. Civilized versus uncivilized, and they won't give military access. And it's the same penalty as if you want an alliance. It's just negative 80. So you can't discuss anything with civilized folks. Well, that's just too bad. It's like he thinks we're some kind of monster. Clearly we're not. Huh, we have some Mongol culture over here. Look at that. We got Mongols over here in Mukden. What about Port Arthur? Nope, no Mongols over there. Just here. So what happens when uh, Russia comes and annexes Outer Manchuria? Is there anything we can do to prevent that from happening? Is there anything we can do to hold on to Outer Manchuria, or is that just not possible? Anyone know? Anyone? Anyone? All right, 
right, let's get some more dudes. More dudes. Can't do anything about the Outer Mongolia thing. No, it's not Outer Mongolia, it's Outer Manchuria. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I've never played as Russia or as China. So it I've never I don't know what that event is called, and I don't know what I don't know what causes it either. Uh-oh, Spain's invading Morocco. No fucking way. Really? Demand Tarza. Yeah, or Taza. Darn it, Spain. You're so aggressive. Somebody needs to contain Spain before he goes ballistic. Contain Spain, everybody. It must happen. Well, you know what? Why don't we... Uh... Let's pause here. Oh, it's December 31st. We'll wait till January. There you go. Let's pause here. January 1st, 1843. It's been seven years in game. Uh, we conquered Dynam. And uh, next up's Korea. Just don't tell them we're coming. Uh, they love us. We love them. Shh. Don't tell them we're coming. We're going to come for you, Korea. Oh, I come for you, Korea. But that'll be next time. I'll see you then. Have a good day.